There are three secrets that will keep you from great feng shui. I just want to share this with you. Just before we begin, make sure you hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get notified whenever we release new videos. If my property has negative features or missing sectors and therefore feng shui won't roll from it unless I negate it, this is a false uh, concept, okay? Because the property has negative features and or may have missing sectors, but you don't have to be using those uh, uh, negative uh, areas, nor do you have to fix a missing sector. You just have to use the good area or one of the areas effectively. One is all you need to succeed, okay? Here's the feng shui secret number two. I don't know how to read landforms and I don't have superior landforms because uh, this is another people think that, oh, I need all these nice mountains and nice water. I need all that. Yes, it is some ways true, but you don't need that to make improvements instantaneously. Let's talk about number three. This is another secret trick. I don't have the money to renovate. Until, until now, think about this. Did we ever talk about needing anything to renovate your home? No, we didn't ask you to renovate your house. You don't have to move your uh, entire uh, kitchen away and uh, install a bedroom in that sector. No, we didn't ever do that. You don't need that. You just have to use one hour of that space to work on, intentionally work on one area of your life. So that's why I need you to understand the correct mindset one more time before you could be using feng shui. This is, if you don't have, you have the wrong mindset, I can give you the best formulas in the world, the best techniques in the world and nothing will happen. The correct mindset is this, right? You need to have an upward spiral, at least you see the positive end. It's very simple, people complain, 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 complain. This is called downward spiral, okay? Freeloaders are part of this group as well, yeah? You may say, oh, but I don't have money, that's why I'm freeloading. Listen, the more you do that, the more, the, the deeper the hole you will go, all right? It's like people lining up in a, in a, short, a supermarket waiting for free coffee, right? Those are the people that will never be able to afford a coffee a coffee machine or even get higher in their life. Don't be one of them, right? You gotta at least change from the mindset level. You can't change to the actual level. Change the mindset level first. You say, but my mom is like, that. slap, 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 okay? Don't do that. Listen, you gotta turn, turn yourself into something of value. The mindset need to change. Make positive, positivity happen. Go to upward spiral, easier for feng shui to take effect for you because then you become receptive towards this. This is so important. Get to the right mindset. So when we are talking about this, to get from here, struggling, people are struggling to get to survive. That mindset change is important before feng shui change can take place. If the mindset is wrong in the first place, I can do everything in the feng shui and the mind still thinks not good enough. No, okay? This is why you must change it from the mind level first, right? The mind, the intel intellect level you change, the rest will follow. And that's how you get from one stage to another. Let's go deeper into this. We didn't have a chance to go deeper into this yesterday. If you're part of the strugglers group, this is how you're feeling. You're feeling like a victim. This economy is bad for me. It's unfair. I don't have this. I don't have that. Emotionally, you feel adverse. You're scared, right? You feel betrayed all the time. People betray you. This partner is no good. Who is the most suitable partner for me? Who will not betray me? Be someone that is unbetrayable. Okay, you gotta make your know, unbetrayable. Nobody can betray you because you're good. If you feel things are unfair, you feel there's always cheated, always react, you know, making poor decisions all the time, always feel unhappy, unfulfilled, and more losses than wins in life. It's time to move from the downward spiral upwards. Be receptive to a bit with feng shui. Stop complaining about your life. Take action. Okay. Next one is the uh, survivors. If you're survivors, that means you're in adjustment, uh, reset, experimentation and uh, realignment. And this is how you feel if, as a, a person in the uh, survivor category. You're still a victim of the circumstances. It gets tough. You achieve some success in life, but the results are inconsistent. Sometimes it's overwhelming. You feel a bit stuck. Some things are going, some things are not going. And sometimes it might even fall back to struggling. And you feel a little bit that something is missing. So if you feel what I just described earlier on, okay? If I feel, you feel that what I just described earlier on, you possibly um, are going through a survival mode. But not to worry, you're somewhere in the middle of that spiral. But try and get at least the mental side up to the uh, trivers uh, section. If you're thriving, you feel fulfilled. Even the, whatever the economy is happening, you will see the opportunities right now instead of seeing the, uh, oh, I don't have this, uh, I can't do this because I wasn't trained to do that. Well, get yourself trained, right? So, you to be passionate. You're more passionate at work. You know that your work can make a difference or if not, you will make a difference because you're contributing. 
uh, you have meaningful career, you're not freeloading anybody, right? And you, you found ways to sustain growth and you have a nice way of life. So this is where you want to get to. This is where you're truly happy. So uh, it takes a bit of time, but it's possible. Once you get there, you'll be in a restoration stage and you will be able to adapt to the new norm with no problems whatsoever. So remember this, the key to progress, the key is this, progress over perfection. You can't get all the thing combinations, like you know everything before you start. Make a bit of progress. Every day, you make some progress, you're moving closer and closer to the thriving stage. Just make some progress. You don't go, don't get pro, uh, perfection. There's no way to be, can be perfect. There's no way you can learn every single thing. Learn something and move forward.